Hi everybody, it's Chef Martin from Thermoworks and today we're going to cook some picanha. Picanha is usually cooked on a rotisserie, but not everyone has a rotisserie at home. So today we're going to show you how you can get results just as good as a rotisserie, but with a barrel cooker instead. We're gonna get those temperatures just right and it's gonna be amazing. First, we're gonna load it onto the skewers by folding it in half and sticking the skewer in. Then we're going to season it very well with coarse salt, some onion powder, some garlic powder, some herbs, and some crushed pepper. Just look at how that coarse salt goes on there. It looks almost like it's crystallized beef, almost like it's candied or something like that. Yum. We're going to hang these in the smoker at 300 degrees and pull them when they get to 130 for medium rare. When our meat got to 130 degrees on our leave-in probe, we verified the temperature with the Thermopen 1 to make sure that that was the lowest temperature. We couldn't find anything below 130 in there, so we pulled it from heat. Now it's ready to go. We're gonna slice into it and give it a taste. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Try this at home. Even without a rotisserie, you can make terrific picanha at home if you pay attention to temperatures. Cook it at 300 degrees, give it a little char towards the end and aim for 130 in the center. You're gonna end up with beautiful, juicy, tender, medium rare picanha that you're absolutely going to love. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please consider subscribing so you can get more of our great content. Until next time from Thermoworks, happy cooking.